this five-year-old Mongo again. Um, training him in elk camp. I actually started riding him just bareback in a halter, which I don't necessarily recommend for everyone. I've been riding many years and have a lot of experience bareback. Um, I have, and still it's not without its risks. And um, I have a halter here with 14-foot lead rope. I've got a little extra lead line so I can do an emergency dismount off him if he starts acting up and still have hold of him. But uh, he's been a lot of fun to work with. I wouldn't do this with just any mule, but he's just got this really gentle puppy dog personality. He's not reactive. He's not spooky. So we figured we'd try something new out here and we've been having a lot of fun with him. I like him to stand when I first get on, and he's already figured out the lateral flexion game. When I first get on him, I ask him to laterally flex, both to the right and the left. He's very flexible, and he likes the way my shoelaces taste. <sighs> Good boy. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Going to taste my shoelaces. And I'm going to ask him to move forward. This is the part we've been working on. Come on. Good boy. Good boy. So just asking him to walk forward. Lightly steering him. With the halter. Good boy. Good boy. Quick learner, a very sweet meal. Tall, thick, beautiful build. 